Hey everybody and welcome to Cardcore. My name is Craig and I'm assisted my duties by my son. What's up everybody? This is Baby Shrek. All right, and uh, if it's your first time with us, thank you for jumping in the trenches. If it's not, if you've been with us before, thanks for coming back. So uh, today we're gonna go a little crazy. Baby Shrek, tell us what's going on. We are opening 18 hanger packs of the 2023 <laughs> Panini Mosaic. That's it. Uh, Panini, oh, 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 I thought it's a prestige. 18 hanger packs of the 2023 mosaics and before you think why 18 it's because the store only had 18 well that's not true i got 18 over a period of three days i was not that person that went to the store and just took everything off the shelf i got 18 over the course of three days um i did go back on the fourth hoping there was at least two more so i can call it 20 but they were all gone so so i was not that guy that yeah. just ripped everything off the shelves. They were there three days in a row, 24 hours in between visits to the to Target, and I came up with 18 of them. So hopefully we find something good between 18 of them. If you watched our other videos, the hanger packs seem to be doing pretty well in the mosaic line. Yes. Um, nothing super spectacular yet, but they've they've produced the most uh, non base cards, you know, on average. So. With that being said, let's just, let's go. I will I will throw a disclaimer out there. Two of these packs, um, I bought these right after they got released, and um, which was about a month ago or so. And two of these packs, I just, I just couldn't wait. I was undisciplined. I hazed myself for it, but I opened two of them. But I put them back in the packs. I'm, I can't remember if I sleeved them or not, but they're back in the packs exactly as they came. Nothing, nothing was swapped out. <laughs> um, so here we go. Hanger number one. Baby Shrek's over there. He's getting pens and papers out. I'm not sure what he's got going on over there. What are you doing? Timestamps for the YouTube video. Oh, timestamps for the YouTube video. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. So here we go. Base, Jordan Love, Joe Burrow, Javante Williams, Jim Kelly, Isaiah Pacheco, Jason Kelsey, NFL debut, Jake Hayner, Malik Willis, Paris Johnson Jr., Darius Davis, Green Mosaic, Jared Goff, National Pride. I feel like there's two cards. No, there's not two cards there. Jalen Waddle, Camo Pink, Archie Manning. Woo! Um, Kalija Kansi, Kalija Kansi, <laughs> um, Devonte Adams on the Elevate, and Rhonda Moore Stevenson on Epic Performers. Let's go. Pack number two. I'm not even sure which two of these. Baby Shrek set these up, so I'm not even sure where the two that I already opened are. And I'm gonna be honest; I did not even notice them. Yeah, I taped. So. I, I made it. I made it look real. <laughs> <laughs> Kelvin Hill, Ed Reed on the base, Michael Thomas, Hunter Renfro, National Pride, Delvin Cook. Nice. Scary Terry, Michael Mayer, Tyre, Ty, Tyree Wilson. <gasps> oh, backwards! It's backwards. We're gonna. We're gonna. Save that. Brock Purdy on the green mosaic. Dak Prescott on the camel pink. Nick Bosa, camel pink. Brenton Strange on the camel pink. Ezekiel Elliott on the Thunder Lane on the wrong team. <laughs> um, yeah. Ezekiel Elliott on the Thunder Lane green mosaic. It's the exact same picture. And, and he's still on the wrong team. And Drake London... Silver mosaic. Well, why was that backwards? Why was that backwards? I, I was. I, I thought there was gonna be an auto there. I saw drink oh. London was backwards. I thought I was. I was. I thought we got an auto. <laughs> All right then. That was pack number three. That was pack number two. Uh. All right. We got on the base. T Higgins, Dallas Clark. I haven't seen him in a while. He was a good tight end. Justin Jefferson, Sky Moore. Bijan Robinson on the NFL debut, TJ Watt, Jartavius Martin, Broderick Jones, another backwards card. We're just going to flip it just because the last backwards card was just a silver prism, or, or I'm sorry, a silver mosaic, and this one is, is, is <coughs> as well. Kaliza Kansi, Deontay Banks Ooh, nice. on, on the green mosaic, CeeDee nice. Lamb on the pink camo. Mark Andrews, Shannon Sharp, Mike Evans on the Elevate, and Epic Performers, Ooh. Patrick Mahomes. Nice. 
pack number four. <laughs> I, would, I know you guys didn't think I sounded too confident when I said pack number four. <laughs> like, this guy can't count to four. <laughs> Keyshawn Johnson, Dan Hampton, Jimmy Garoppolo, Darius Slade Jr., Geno Smith, Jared Goff on a National Pride, Anthony Ooh, Richardson. There we go. Julius Brents, another backwards card. Is it going to be another silver mosaic? Yes, it is. Max Crosby. Nice. Brees Hall, color match. And green nice. And the green, Very nice. And the green uh, mosaic. Dan, I always get I always get tongue tied on saying mosaic every yeah. single time. Dan Hampton, Camo Pink, Michael Pittman Jr., Joe Thomas. Oh, Saquon, Saquon Barkley. Barkley, touchdown masters. Cool That's picture. Cool, yeah. Cool picture. Man, look at him biceps. And that dude's been he, he's 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 been IT'd a lot. He's got the <laughs> he's got legs the size of tree trunks. Yeah. Jamar Chase on the silver prism. Um Yeah. I, w I wonder if, I wonder if he's seen that card. He's like, yeah, that's a good bicep shot right there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he It's his Tinder profile picture. <laughs> it'd be funny if he doesn't even do twenty pull ups though. <laughs> Be like, what's up with 20 pull-ups? Max to PFT, man. Luke yeah. Keikley, Jeremy Kramer, T-Law. <laughs> it's a funny nickname. Comment below your favorite DeAndre's. player nickname and nickname. Yeah, yeah. Favorite player nicknames. Past and present. Best nicknames out there. Um, what do we got? Ray Lewis. Nice. On the Hall of Fame. Chris Godwin. Emmanuel Forbes. Will Anderson Jr. <gasps> Backwards. It's, backwards. it's Dorian Thompson Robinson on the oh. NFL debut, Silver Mosaic. They're tricking us. Yeah, watch. I know. It, it, watch. There's going to be one where it's backwards. We're going to be like, eh, it's not one. And then it is. Yeah. It, it, it is. That's, that's what it's going to be. I'm trying to feel like a kaleidoscope or something like yeah. that. Jalen Carter. So, yeah, in this line, we're, we're looking for kaleidoscopes. We're looking at Darnell Williams Jr. on the. On the Bang and AJ Brown on the touchdown masters. Nice. Silver mosaic. Kid reporter. Nice. Here we go. What pack are we on now? Five? Is this five? Did yeah. I never say five? Yeah. All right. Michael Pittman Jr. I guess I could count the ones on the floor. Michael Pittman Jr. Joe Thomas. Henry Ellard. Tiki Barber. Today has been Tiki Barber. Yeah, it has been. Julio Jones, Jerome Bettis, and the Hall of Fame. Nice. The bus. Tank Bigsby, Garrett Williams, Dak Prescott. It's backwards. <laughs> it is. And the Silver Mosaic, Rasheed Rice, Green Mosaic, Ty Law, Camel Pink, Larry, Larry Johnson, Micah Parsons on the bang. Hey, look, he's hitting a... Uh, I'm assuming that's Daniel Jones. Yeah, it would be Daniel Jones. He, yeah, was rookie. he was a rookie last year, right? Yeah. Yeah, so Daniel Jones. And Josh Jacobs on the Thunder Lane. Moving on along. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. This is pack number seven. So, yes, I did I did mess up the count somewhere along the way. Mm. There's one of those don't steal me cards. They're all backwards. Yeah. They're all uh, autographs. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine that. Anthony Munoz on the base, Marquise Brown, Fletcher Cox, they'd be Jack, like, they'd, Jack Youngblood. They'd be like, that's the pack that they had taped up. <laughs> yeah, right. Put all the good cards in there. Yeah, Will, Will Levis on the NFL debut, nice. Traylon Burks, Jair Brown, CJ Stroud. CJ Stroud, there we go. There you go. And base card, CJ Stroud, but still. Justin Jefferson, it's backwards. <laughs> It's <laughs> Silver Mosaic, Justin, Jefferson, it, Jeff, Justin Jefferson. They're just screwing with us now. Alvin Kamara. Somebody in the factory did that on purpose. Teddy Bruschi, Alan Page, Christian <coughs> Poirier, A.J. Brown in the Touchdown there Masters, and Steve Young on the Silver Prism. Nice card. This one fell over. Let's just go over here since it fell over. Yeah. Hopefully none of the cards got damaged. Yeah, that'll be the one, right? Yeah, that's that'll be, the, be one. the one with the with the glass mosaic. Dick Butkus. Nice. Jonathan Taylor. There we go, Jonathan. Okay. That's one time. for today. Eric Dickerson, Tyler Lockett. You know, ever since we started our uh, Count? Debo Samuel and 
and uh, Jonathan Taylor count. We haven't been pulling them as much. Yeah, we haven't. Peyton Manning. CJ Stroud. On the, on the uh, Hall of Fame. Bryce Young. Uh, I, I said CJ Stroud. I know. Come on, man. The, we already pulled The team you. that should have drafted CJ Stroud. Yeah, I know. Hey, you know, I bet the Panthers right now are like, hey, I think we were wrong. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I could have told you that before the draft. He's too short. Yeah. Yep. Kelly Ringo on the uh, Silver Mosaic. Michael Vick, Epic Performers Green Mosaic. Color match. And, and, and that's Michael Vick from the uh, Falcons. Falcons years. Yeah. Nick Chubb and the Camo Pink. Cordell Patterson. Russell Wilson. And Patrick Mahomes on the Epic Performers. The la no, it's not the last one. Touchdown Masters, Joe Burrow. Nice. I was going to say something, but I, I first thought that that was the last pack. I saw Joe Burrow on the back, but then I saw Patrick Mahomes on the front, and I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> oh, this is one of the ones I taped. Oh, yeah. It's, it's, it's a taped one, and I didn't sleeve them. What did you So get? this is, this is how they know. were. This is why they're backwards. Tank Bigsby. On the camel pink, yeah, you weren't here when I opened these. I was, yeah, I was doing night ops. <laughs> Touchdown Masters, <laughs> Jonathan Taylor, Jonathan Taylor on the Thunder Lane. That's um, two for Jonathan green. Taylor today. Keyshawn Johnson on the pink, Von Miller, <clears throat> pink, Zay Flowers, nice. On the green, Shaquille Leonard on the silver mosaic, Cameron Latou on base, Jordan Addison, Zach Charbonnet on the NFL debut, Sam Howell, Devonte Smith. Maurice Jones, Drew, Andre Johnson, and Patrick Sertain, the second. All right, that's uh, that's nine right there. We got nine to go. Baby Shrek, you want to rip these? Sure. These nine, maybe you'll have some better luck than I got. Yeah. All right. So what do, you, what do you think so far of these 18 packs? Um, all right, so I think what we've noticed in the past, in, in the past of the uh, hangers is you go about 50-50 base to non-base cards, and just looking at the stacks, Right now, I still think it's pulling 50-50. Yeah. So, in fact, we might want to start a second stack at a non-base card. Yeah, I'm because going to. I don't want it to fall over. Yeah. Yeah, there's only only so long before they topple. Comes the, the Tower of Pisa. Yeah. All right, here we go. Shannon Sharp, Brian Burns, Chris Carter, Reggie Wayne, I tell you, I've been looking forward to opening these 18 packs. We're yeah. sitting in here. Randy Moss, Tariq Woolen, Sheen Cl Sean Clifford, Drew Sant. This guy more on the Soul silver mosaic. mosaic. You gonna separate, uh, you gonna separate that? Oh yeah. Too disappointed. It doesn't deserve to go into the special pile. <laughs> no, that's not bad. Yeah. Mm. Amon Ross St. Brown. Imagine if every one of these back ones went raw autographs. Just pulling the autograph every pack. I I'd be very happy. Yeah. Dorian Thompson. Robinson. On the pink. That's the NFL pink. debut. Yeah. And, oh, yeah. NFL debut on the pink. I think that's the first pink NFL debut I've seen. I think so. I know we pulled the yellow ones in the past yeah. out, of the, out of the mega boxes. Richard Sherman. Sherman. Jamar Chase. Pink mosaic on the National Pride. That's nice. It's camo pink. Camo pink. It's the tactical, Sorry. It's the tactical version. Mm. Fred Warner. On the bang, that's a cool picture. He's like body slamming. <laughs> yes, him. yeah. He's <laughs> going so WWE. Someone's getting hit hard. Tank Bigsby. No, no, and, that's a silver prism. Oh, sorry. Silver prism. And elevate Mike Evans on the green mosaic. Let's move that over there. So, uh, while you're so going through anything that, anything happening in the NFL world? Yeah, I'm about to. I'm about to pull it up. Let's check out the standings. Um. Where did my mouse go? It is over here. All right. Jerry Judy, Von Miller, Jared Goff. Oops. Derek Carr, Brock Purdy, not as exciting as last year. Nope. Adrian, uh, Jordan Addison on the NFL debut. Trey Tucker. Wait. Oh, I'm thinking of Trey Hawkins. I was about to say wrong team. But Jameer Gibbs. <sighs> Chris Johnson, it back, okay, it's, it's just a silver mosaic. It's still not bad, not just yeah. a, not just a, but you know. Yeah, Reggie It's Wayne. disappointing it is backwards. Yeah, Derrick Henry on the pink, the camo pink. 
Mosaic, Will Anderson Jr. on the pink Mosaic NFL debut, Garrett Williams, pink Epic Performer, C.D. Lamb, and Odell Beckham Jr. on the Elevate, him oh. in a Ravens uniform. Okay, all right, so here we go. Speaking of the Ravens, the Ravens are on top in the north with uh, two games, well, a game and a half over the Steelers and the Browns, the Bengals, five and six. They're probably going nowhere fast, being that they lost uh, Joe Burrow. Chiefs, eight and three, leading the west. In the south, you got the Jags at eight and three. Two games better than the Colts in second place. The Dolphins also at eight and three. So the end of the AFC is kind of stacked right there. I mean, between the, all the division leaders, you got nine and three, eight and three, eight and three, and eight and three. So the Ravens have the one seed, but they've played the extra game, and the extra game was a win. Yeah. So that puts the pressure on the Chiefs, the Jaguars, and the Dolphins to keep pace. Yes. NFL debut, Anthony Richardson. Nice. Very nice. Anything else? Um, all right. So in the NFC. The Eagles obviously leading leading the NFL at ten and one. They pulled out that uh, last night. They pulled out that field goal in the uh, and it was overtime. Yeah, overtime over the uh, um, who the Bills? The Bills. That's yeah. that's that's who it was. You know, the Bills put together a good game. Josh Allen did have a couple turnovers, of course. But um, that that, that was a close one. But the Eagles squeaked it out. Um, so they're ten and one, solid lead over the 49ers at eight and three. The Lions eight and three, and well, the Falcons are five and six, leading their division, the, tied with the Saints at five and six. I don't think anybody's scared of the Saints or the Falcons. No, no. You, I mean, you, you you figure you've got the Eagles, the Cowboys, the 49ers, and then there's the Lions who had that horrible loss on Thanksgiving. Um, yeah. I mean, they they non-competitive. I thought. You know, this just looked non-competitive, and that was their time to shine. Yeah. So that's that's what's cracking right now. We're about, in the about NFL to get an Archie, We're about to get an Archie Manning autograph. <laughs> no, no, you're not. You're getting a silver prism. Yeah, silver so prism. Chris Olave, green mosaic. Jared Goff on the National Pride pink mosaic. Julio Jones in a in a Buccaneers uniform, pink mosaic. Jerome Bettis, pink mosaic. Hall of Fames. Thunder Lane, Najee Harris, and Prism, uh, Silver Prism, Paris Johnson Jr. Okay. You know, I'm typically not a fan of pink parallels. Yeah. Because, uh, well, you're not getting a color match unless they're wearing, like, their, uh, yeah. their October uniforms or gloves or what have you. But the mosaic pinks actually look better than... Oh, this is a taped up one. Okay. The other lines that were pink, that have pink parallels, the mosaics actually look nice. That, that that pink camel pink prism. Epic performers, Ramor Stevenson, Thunder Lane, Frank Gore. I think that's the first Frank Gore card I've ever seen. Nah, you, you've seen him before. No. Will McDonald. That's short term memory right there. <laughs> Will McDonald. <laughs> Sing it. Sing Will you McDonald started it. Sing it. <laughs> Minka. Fitzpatrick, Patrick Holmes on the pink National Pride. Did you just say Minka Fitzpatrick? Yeah, it's Minka. Oh, okay. You were well, you were holding Patrick Mahomes, oh. and I was like, um, dude, you're like <laughs> way off, way <laughs> off. You, you know, I didn't remember pulling that card. You said that was a taped up pack. Yeah. Okay, I didn't remember pulling that card. Yeah, it's a nice. Card. That's not bad. Yeah, it's not bad at all. Darren Payne on the pink mosaic. Kenneth Walker, green mosaic. Anton Harrison, Silver Mosaic, Jonathan Mingo, Will McDonald, <laughs> Will Anderson Jr., NFL debut, Derek Henry, Fred Taylor, Wes Welker, DJ Moore, and Billy White Shoes Johnson. Hey, you know why they call him White Shoes? Because he always had the whitest sneakers. You know why he always had the whitest sneakers? Why? Because he spit shined those things. He did? Yeah, that guy used to spit shine his cleats. That was like, what spit shine? Oh my god! <laughs> People out there, tell somebody, leave a comment. Tell this kid what spit shining is. All right, how are you gonna be in the corner and not spit shine your shoes? I don't care if they're go fasters. You need to spit shine them. Billy White Shoes Johnson spit shined his go fasters. <laughs> That's why they call him White Shoes. <laughs> He had the the he he took Pam's Dundee for yeah the white the whitest shoes yeah Pam's Dundee National pride for all you office fans yeah. out there. 
Uh oh, NFL debut. Uh, or bang. Jameer Gibbs. Oh, Silver Mosaic. Jameer Gibbs, NFL debut. Nice. That's nice. Jamar. What are you doing? <laughs> Jamar Chase on the National Pride. Two of them. Oh, in the same pack? Yeah, same pack. All right. <laughs> Yeah, I thought you were like manhandling stuff. No, Fred Taylor. Respect the cards. AJ Brown, Julius Benz, all on the pink mosaic. Chad Ocho Cinco. Yep. There's a nickname for you, Ocho Cinco. Again, everybody, leave comments for your favorite nicknames. Yes. White shoes is pretty good though. Yeah, it is. Spit shine to go fasters. The fridge. That's a good one. Fridge. I know that one. Yeah, the fridge was good. Touchdown Masters. Uh, Stefan Diggs. That's a cool picture. Yeah, it is. Even though he looks like a kicker. Yeah. He just but, kicked the ball. But with that being said, talking about the fridge, let's see. All right, everybody, let's let's just see if this this young whippersnapper knows what was the fridge's real name. <laughs> Hold on. I knew it. Hold on. I knew it. I have heard his name before. <laughs> I just called him the fridge. The fridge. And of course, everybody's like, "All right, Dad, you better say it." Because if you don't yeah, know what it, is it right? William Perry. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I man. I know that name. Wait. Wasn't that also the name of the guy from Friends? That just... I don't know. Yeah, no, I, Matthew Perry. That's that was Matthew, Matthew Perry. Perry. That's Matthew Perry. Oh, Lord, why you got to bring in, in Debbie Downer? What? Yeah. I just... I was confused for a second. Oh, Patrick Mahomes Patrick on the Mahomes National Pride. Yeah, Attention on Dirk. Carry Ken on. Smith. Miles... <gasps> Will it be National Pride Silver Mosaic? Yep. Nice. We're gentle. getting a lot of National gentle Prides. With the merchandise. I am being gentle. Keyshawn Johnson, Michael Thomas, always injured. White, White shoes. shoes. White shoes on the camel Deep pink. Or Spit shining them boots. John Mechie the third on the pink mosaic. I said boots. I'm uh, go fasters. Uh Kid Reporter. Touchdown Masters. And Epic Performers, Green Mosaic, Josh Allen. All right. It's nice. Hey, so, uh, all right, two more packs to two go. More. While we're While we're doing this, I just listed off the standings. Well, not all the standings, but the leaders. Who's, who's the contenders and who's the pretenders, Baby Shrek? I think the Bills are pretenders. You think the Bills are pretenders? Yeah. All right, well, they just took the Eagles to the brink yesterday. Yeah, but it, the Giants also took them to the brink. Hey, the Giants are four and eight right now. Show some respect. They're on. They're on the rise. Oh my God! Too late in the season for that. <laughs> I know. A five more wins in a row, and they'll be nine and eight. Yeah, like last year. <laughs> hey, you know, Two of them are against the Eagles. Come on, man. <laughs> what if the Eagles? What if we beat the Eagles? What if we blow them out? Yeah. What if it's okay. the Giants and Cowboys and, and, game, but the Giants and Eagles and the Giants fact, are on you, top? You, you thought the four, the Cowboys over the Giants was ugly. I, I have to imagine that what the Eagles do to the Giants is going to be uglier. I'd have to imagine. We need to call... Uh, uh, who's the guy from last year? Get it out. The guy, uh, oh, Davis Webb. Davis Webb, yeah. We yes. need to call him back. Kim and... Uh, Kenny Galladay. Kenny Galladay, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe they can win. All right, so you got you got the Bills as pretenders. Yeah, I got the Bills as contenders. The question is, which Bills team shows Ooh, up to the game? Dexy. If if the uh, if the the Doctor Jekyll Bills show up, they're contenders. If it's Mr. Yes. Hyde, if it's Mr. Hyde Bills, they're done. Done sauce. Yeah, I don't, I don't care if they're playing the Giants. They've had more bad games than good games, in my opinion. All right. What about the Cowboys? Let's talk about the Cowboys. The Cowboys. Contenders or pretenders? They haven't beaten anybody really good. I think they're pretenders. You think they're pretenders? Yeah. I think they're, um, again, I think it's the week. I think which, yeah. one, which one shows up? Uh, I'm just I'm just thinking about that game against the 49ers. Yeah. Oh, Tank Dell. He's been doing good. Him, Deontay Banks. Oops, why, why is he going in that pile? What about the Lions? I think Eight and three. I think they're contenders. I think that game on on. Uh, you think they're contenders? <sighs> Stop with your breathing all in the mic. <laughs> I'm thinking. I'm Everybody's thinking. like, oh my. 
I, I think they're on the border of being pretenders. Yeah. Um, Them and the Cowboys are on the border of being here's, pretenders. Here's, here's what I, 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 I think about that. that you know, the Lions are 8-3. and three. They did not look good against the Packers on Thanksgiving at all. And that was their time to show everybody, no, we are contenders. And we're out of cards. Yeah. The Lions are going to show that we're out of cards. Um, so I'm sorry there, Detroit fans. Um, I am pulling for you. I like to see the Lions win. If my team can't win it, I'm not opposed to watching the Lions win it. Yeah, me neither. But you are what you are until you're not, and and uh, they just they got they got beat up pretty bad in prime time. Yeah. The, the other day. You know, we need some. We need the 49ers to win because we have we have Brock Purdy rookie cards. So we need those <laughs> to go up. Okay. That's right. All right. Hey. So that's enough of the NFC, AFC. Before we close out. Dolphins. I think the Jaguars are pretenders. I didn't say anything about the Jaguars. Uh, oh, the oh, Dolphins. Oh. I thought you were saying your opinion on who's a contender and who's a pretender. Dolph I'm asking you. Dolphins, contenders or pretenders? What are they? Depends on the week. You think it depends on the week? Yeah. I think they're contenders, though. All right. Um, Miami, I'm sorry. I think they're pretenders. I think they are pretenders. They haven't beaten anybody good, which I know you only get the games on your schedule, but they are an offensive, specifically passing team, and that stuff works great in September, but not so much January. Yeah. It's just, that's not a January-style football. So, uh, Dolphins, I'm sorry. I just, I'm, not, I'm not seeing it. I think the Browns, though. I think the Browns are contenders. I, I, well, I think they need to find the right quarterback. Yeah, now. they need to find a quarterback, but they, until they find one, I think that they're contenders. Yeah, well, you, you know, uh, there's people out there still. I mean, hey, they could get Tom Brady to come back for a few games. Tom Brady's out there, but hey, you know who else is out there? Who? What was his name? Um, their number one draft pick. Baker Mayfield? No, not Baker Mayfield. Before that, what was his name? Johnny Stop. Manziel. Oh, Johnny, Johnny Manziel. Manziel's out there. Come on, <laughs> Cleveland. You guys want Johnny Manziel back or what? <laughs> leave us a comment. Um, anyway, contenders and pretenders, anybody out there, leave us some comments what you think about any of the teams we mentioned, any teams you got in mind, what you think. Tell us what you think about a reunite. You know, Johnny Manziel mm. and the Browns I think reuniting. We need to see it. Cle we need to see it. <laughs> Cleveland, what would you think about that? Johnny football himself. But, um, all right, so out of the 18 hangers, nothing crazy. Couple, couple decent ones. You know, nothing, nothing. Uh, no, no kaleidoscopes, no autos. Yeah. No stained glasses. No. Let me grab a pack. What else is? What else are we looking for in there? Um, None of the rookie scripts. Actually, I think rookie scripts don't come in the hangers. Um, no Genesis variations. Um, yeah, no Razzle Dazzles. Yeah, no. That's, that's the other one. I knew there was another one besides the stained glass and the uh, kaleidoscopes. It's the Razzle Dazzle. None of those. But as far as... The base the base, base yeah. versus non base cards it's an even fifty yeah, fifty still a, it, yeah so and all of these cards were uh, you know obviously came out of the hangers we bought them out of the Target so they were actually hanging yes. instead of actually sitting on you know sitting on a shelf in the little boxes that they come in so I didn't when the ones that I opened I didn't notice any damaged cards but you know what else what I didn't notice was I didn't notice any trends of print lines on the cards yeah, as well. Yeah, I didn't notice it. I didn't Which see any either. I, I, did, I did see a couple with print lines, but a lot of times when you, when you pull a pack that has print lines, they pretty much all have print lines, yeah. and, and it's atrocious, and that's usually typical that you find in the in the hangers, but yeah. not these ones. So the mosaic hangers, um, they came out really nice condition. Yes, they did. Not print lines, 50-50 on the... On the um, base versus non-base cards, no major hits, but uh, still pretty good. Yeah. Baby Shrek, do you think it's worth buying 18 more of these things? <laughs> I think that if we were to buy 18, we might as well buy all of them there so we get the hit. 
<laughs> yeah, I know, right? Maybe, maybe they were there. Maybe I should have just snatched them all off the shelf <laughs> at the same time. I just didn't want we to be that guy. We have to become those guys. We need yeah. to get the hit. I don't know. Um, anyway, Carcore, anybody out there, if you haven't, if you haven't joined us yet, go ahead and subscribe and listen to Cardcore today. Leave a comment. We'll be back soon um, from the trenches, and we look forward to seeing you. Leave a comment because it's not just my core; it's your core. It's our core. Core!